but take the inside. I think you'll be very pleased with this. First thing you're going to see is the steps, the handrail. Lots and lots of people really like that. Got a dinette right here that makes into a bed. Walk out this set of steps. Just look how cool that, especially if you're into the cowboy way of things. All that saddle scrolling. It's all in the ceiling. All your vents are covered with solid hickory. And there's there's no there's no pasteboard, there's no vinyl in this. I'll just kind of set up here from the seat and kind of give you a look around here. Much walk around room you got. You got three theater seating over there. Doesn't get any more comfortable. I'll have you look around here a little bit. It is absolutely beautiful. Okay. That's your saddle scrolling here in the ceiling. And all your vents and all your stereo speakers are covered with solid hickory as well. A lot of them will have a piece of hickory vinyl. This is solid wood. Solid wood. And then soft touch on the walls. Closet right here. Isn't that really cool how they did that? It looks like a belt. I'm trying to unload it here as, as I'm trying to show it to you. Solid hickory over, over the cabinet or over your shower. Power vent. More saddle scrolling in the ceiling. Solid hickory door here. Guys, look around here. Can you see yourself sitting over here? Making all the memories. Upgraded to convection microwave. Got your, uh, your cowboy hat racks. A friend of mine calls it cowboy, cowboy hat rack. Upgraded all your panel here for your backsplash. All the tongue and groove where everything's locked in. It's not just stapled together. Now I'm going to show you this. They've still got some styrofoam beads here in the floor, but I'm going to walk back here because it's heading for a show. All your walls are lined with a mildew resistant bar there for if you want to use to hang clothes on. You can. You've got an extra closet here in the back. Step back here so you can see that. Then you got your bunk beds that fold down here. And if you don't need bunk beds, we can sure enough take them out. But completely lined here in the mid tack. Got a place here for your saddle racks that will sit right here. We can do that as well. Got your walk out, walk in mid tack there, walk in bedroom, however you want to do that. Got your hay pot up here on the roof. 17.5 tires and wheels. Got your rear ramp. Got a floating center gate. Guys, that, that gate will come back. I'll show you. There's a hole there, 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 and there. So that gate will come all the way back to this location. Right now the saddle racks are in this room, but they can definitely be moved into the into the mid-tack room. They're just, just set up right now for this kind of attack room. Got a door entering over here. Get all your plexiglass in it. You got tie rail down this side here for, for your horses. All aluminum frame, aluminum floor. And for those of you guys that have never heard of Murhow, got the real good, uh, what's well, got your generator rack up there. Nice swing out ladder here. 
17.5, 16 ply radials. Yeah, I don't know if this is unlocked or not. It's not. I'm not sure what that's about. I'll try to figure, figure that out, get some pictures of it. Let's take you down here underneath it. Show you how everything's put together, guys. Look what a floor. A double framed. Floor from front to back, all aluminum frame and floor. I mean, they've spent, spent a lot of time engineering this. They've been doing these trailers since 19, for, since 1954, so 68 years this year. There's your full escape door there. I don't know what's that, what, I, what else I can tell you about it. The quality is huge. Quality is huge. I walked around the other side of this pickup truck. The power awning on it. They just keep coming out of there. All right. 